Okay, hello guys, what is up, Cody here, and uh, last time, uh, if you skipped it, I don't blame you, it was all optional stuff, but it was pretty funny, some of the dialogue, so, there's that, uh, the only thing that we did that was mandatory was, we read the article, and we found out that, uh, Edna knows how to forge signatures, and we have to do something to look into that, and what I'm thinking is, it's the pen, because you use a pen to forge signatures, so I'm gonna try giving that to Harvey and see if he can go into the past with that piece of information. Shall I draw you a tattoo, Harvey? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah! Can you draw <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, a Chinese okay. dragon on my shoulder blades? Great <laughs> not. Your back is simply too fuzzy. Okay, so that was just a little piece of hilariosity. I guess so we cannot... I thought the pen would be the piece of information we needed to forge, but I guess not, so... Huh. Okay, then, I guess I was wrong, but yeah, that's everything. I did everything in this room that I know of. I don't think I missed anything. And if I did, it was probably just something with the toenail and probably clicking on something with it, but... Okay, so we Yikes. can... What? Oh, hello. Well, if it isn't Miss Edna, how did you manage to get out of your cell? Uh... I had to go to the bathroom and got lost. I had help from the outside. I don't think I'll be able to say all these, so I have to pick a. I have to pick one. I. Wait, why does it say I I? I'll. I'll I don't know. <laughs> I possess secret powers. That mini golf guy let me out. The rag doll rabbit tempo morphed me to the past. I kind of want to say that one. None of your business, bucko. Uh, I had help from the outside. No, he'll think we're crazy. I had to go to the bathroom and got lost. Eh, it's kind of believable, but... And again, the guy said he would not ever bring me out to go to the bathroom. I possess secret powers. Uh, he'll think I'm crazy. The mini, go mini golf guy let me out. He can testify and say that he didn't. My rag doll. This would prove I'm crazy, but I kind of want to say that. So I'm going to say my rag doll rabbit temple morphed me to the past. <laughs> My ragdoll rabbit temple morphed me to the past. That's where I learned to use my super toenails as a multi-tool. <laughs> <laughs> You've always been very resourceful. It's a shame not much of that will be left. Whoa. Once Dr. Marcel's therapy begins to work. Come on now, I'll put you back in your cell. Ha! Never! Uh... Ha, never. I want to talk to Dr. Mars about once. Don't you want to know how I can escape? It's not too late to become friends. I'm gonna say, don't you know? Don't you want to know how I escape? Don't you want to know how I can escape? Sure, fire away. Uh, oh, I can pick all these options. Cool. I thought I could only pick one, cause I thought he would chase me afterwards. Um, or put me back into my cell. Let's say, let's say I had to go to the bathroom and got lost. I had to go to the bathroom and got lost. Oh, come to Ulgor and I'll show you the way. The way back to your cell. <laughs> ha! Never! Don't All you right. want to know how Let's to pick sure. the other options. I had help from I the outside. I had help from the outside. <laughs> From whom, I might ask? Your dead father, maybe? Dead? Your dad is dead? You might not remember everything, but this asylum is your home now. My dad can't be it dead. I don't believe that. He probably killed time. someone. It's more likely he killed someone than I'll he is the fact that he's dead. In your cell. Ha! Never! I like how he doesn't say anything about the rabbit talking. Or maybe I'm the only one that can hear it. Who knows? Uh... Don't, Don't you want to escape? Sure. All right. I possess secret I possess powers. Secret powers. I still don't know why it said I twice. I'll turn you into a bulldog. Oh yeah. A bulldog. Luga. Oh, he got mad after it that. It worked. I didn't know I had it in me. Wait, what? Quit this nonsense and get over here already. Did she think she I'll actually put turned you him into back a in your cell? Bulldog. Ha, never. Uh, I don't don't quite you want to know? Sure. What happened there? Alright, the last two are that 
mini golf guy let me out. That mini golf guy let and me out. Your business. Babbitt, he's getting less and less reliable. Huh? Dr. Marcel will be frothing at the mouth when he comes back from town. Be that as it may, you're coming with me now. No. I'll put you back in your cell. Ha! Never! Don't you want sure. Alright, let's say none of your business, bucko. None of your business, bucko. I don't even care. Of course as you do. As long as you come over here, so I can put you back in your cell. Ha! Never! Alright, so we can't say that anymore. Wait, what happens if I do say that, though? Don't you want to- Sure! Oh, okay, None just, of your- It's an endless <laughs> loop of that. Okay. Hi, never. I want to talk to Dr. Marshall. Don't you know how I got- We already said that. It's not too late to become friends. Once- what do you know about my father? What do you know about my father? I think that just Besides opened up. Besides him being a murderer? Those are lies. I eavesdropped on you. Mm -hmm. Listen, sweetheart. Your father was a murderer. <laughs> he admitted his guilt, and he was sentenced. That's all you need to know. He could have been under pressure and say that he was guilty, or someone else could have testified for him. So, you can't necessarily say that. Uh, hold on. All you missed was me saying that, uh, the father didn't te- What? The fuck? Okay, anyway, uh, let's say... It's not too late to become friends. It's not too late to become friends. We are not your enemies, Edna. Will you stop erasing my memory and destroying my ego, then? Tuh. Oh, um, no, probably not. Did they just admit it? <laughs> Great friends. Tuh. What's that? Are you coming now? Probably better friends than some people in the world today. Like, <clears throat> I know friends that have friends that backstabbed friends. It's not fun. Uh, let's say I want to talk to him at once. I want to talk to Dr. Marcel at once. The doctor is out. You can talk to him as now, soon as Now I don't he's believe back. that. I don't Until believe then, that he's out. You'll be put back in your cell. Never. As you wish. We might as well wait here. Oh, we've been waiting Even here like for the past five all minutes already. Day long. I've got plenty of time. Me too. I can just leave my computer on this whole time. Wait. So. We're just gonna have like a staring contest here. What happens if I crawl in through the crate? They don't even give me that option, they just give me the option to walk around the desk. So I guess we'll do that. Wait, no, I didn't want hey. you to go that way around. Ah, what are you doing? And, uh, go, 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 go! <laughs> Man, this guy's an idiot. <laughs> Uh, okay. Is this gonna be an endless loop here? Do I have to watch this whole thing again? Oh wait, he's not stopping me. Hey! All right, yeah, I guess that does do everything again. Well then, there's obviously something we have to do here. I feel like I need to look at my inventory real quick. All right, we got an encyclopedia. I don't think that will help. A polo mallet. We might be able to hit him on the head. Uh, should we consult Harvey about this? If you don't step away from the door immediately, I'll set my attack rabbit on you. <laughs> <laughs> sick, kind of like that sick. game Raving Grr. Rabbits or whatever. Grr. Okay. Uh, so Harvey's kind of useless in this situation. What if I give him my toenails? Hey! Stop that! <laughs> Where does she keep the, keep the, uh, clippers on her? I don't know. Uh, let's see what happens if I do the encyclopedia. Would you like to read something? <laughs> Are you trying to make fun of me? <laughs> I might not look like it, but I read a lot during my spare time. A lot of what? Like Playboy what? magazines? Tolstoy? Hemingway? 
Voltaire? What the Beatrix hell is that? Potter. Ha! Beatrix Potter, well, that's obviously a parody of Harry Potter. Those are all just made up names. <laughs> Beatrix Potter. I don't know what the other ones were, but I do know the Harry Potter one. I'm sure the other ones were real books too, just parodies of some. Uh how about No don't do the chair. I don't do think I have to mark the, the broken chair leg. Nobody no. will steal it anyway. <laughs> Nobody will steal it. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to. The pen is supposed to be mightier than the sword. <laughs> but these forearms look like the shock absorbers on a truck. Draw a mustache on them. All right, let's do the broken chair. I won't even try that. All right, let's resort to the polo mallet, which I'm sure is what you have to do. What? I said do the polo mallet. Whoa. <laughs> okay, I guess that is what you gotta do. Now let's drag the body and throw him out the window. No, I'm kidding. Uh, Alright, let's, let's see what she has to say about it. <laughs> who the champ? Who the champ? Edna! <laughs> who the champ? Say it louder! <laughs> Edna! Who the champ? Let's talk through it again. Give me an E! E! e. Give me a D! D! e Give me an N! N. N! Give me a U! Y U? What's that spell? Edna? Edna! Yippee! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Edna? <laughs> what the hell does Edna? <laughs> oh, whatever. <clears throat> Can we talk through it again? Give me an E! e Alright, E, D, U. Or E, D, and Edna. Okay, uh. Let's get Harvey. What do you think, Harvey? Shall we put him above our mantelpiece? <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get the wood shavings and you get the spoon. Whoa, I think he's experienced. Uh, let's see what the encyclopedia. Knockout. Knockout. <laughs> How about the toenail? I put a nod of toenail into his mouth. Oh, <laughs> what a, wow. Well, now we gotta bite another I toenail off. I admit that it's fun, but one is enough for now. What? Oh, I thought she said... I thought we got rid of the toenail because we put it in his mouth. Alright, how about the pole mallet again? Nah, he's had enough. You could probably finish him off. What about the pen? I gave him a mustache. <laughs> you gave him a mustache? That's exactly what I said! Like, not even a, two minutes ago, I said give him a mustache, and she did. <laughs> I am not Dr. Van Housen, this and this is not Dracula. Uh, I'd probably understand the reference if I actually knew. If I actually see Dracula. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think that's everything. <laughs> she drew a mustache on him. That's exactly what I'd said. Okay, so I guess that's everything we can do here, and I guess now we can leave. I should get rid of Holger first. Come on, get rid we of can him? clean up later. No, somebody could find him and sound the alarm. You have experience with this kind of thing, don't you? <laughs> I've played Manhunt. <laughs> All right. Uh, can I put him in the cabinet? Open it. Pick up the body. Yes, I should get rid of him. But where to put him? The cabinet! Ah, I know! The cabinet! <laughs> you want him upside down? The blood could rush to his head and you could kill him that way, you know? And how'd you even tie him up to the. Ah, whatever, video game logic. <clears throat> Close it. You should have the dignity to close it. There you go. Oh, wait. Open it back up. Oh, can I do anything extra with the... It isn't screwed together. It... Uh... What do you think of this... Yucky! 
Okay, they're acting like the cabinet is him. So there's nothing new there. Uh, or he's the cabinet, either way. Alright, that's officially all we can do with this room. Sorry it took me like 30 minutes. I just wanted to do everything I could. Okay, now we are in the main hall.